we do this every time? Hello, friends. Hello, friends. I want to make sure that I'm in focus. Okay, I, can, I say this every time, but I think what had happened was, I don't know if you remember if you watched the main channel, but a while back, a few months ago, I don't remember how long ago it was, I dropped my camera. Well, I didn't drop it, it fell. Anyway, it got messed up. And I think the little focus thing is messed up in it. At least that's what I'm going with. But anyway, welcome back. It feels like it's been like three months since I have filmed a video on this channel. Has it been that long? Almost. Almost that long. I think the last one we did was the drinks, right? Mm -hmm. Did you guys try any of those drinks? If you did, let me know down below. But um, also, Happy New Year. I hope you had a wonderful Christmas. Did you have a good Christmas? I'm talking to Debbie. Debbie, come here. Did you have a good Christmas? It was amazing. <laughs> what was your favorite part? The games. Really? We, we had a good time. Um, I have that vlog. I don't know if it's, it's not finished yet. I'll finish it. I don't know which one of these videos is gonna come out first, but I do have a vlog of Christmas and the games that we played, etc., etc. I also know that in the drink video, the um, bright, was it bright and boozy? I think that's what it was bright called. And boozy. Boozy and Bright, whatever. The drink video that we did for Christmas. I know that we had mentioned that we were gonna do another video on like the little sides, like the hors d'oeuvres, like the um, sausage balls and stuff, but we didn't get to do that. Um, it's been crazy with the holidays. Um, Mom has been gone back and forth to West Virginia. My grandmother has been sick. She's been taking care of her. It's just been a lot, so we haven't had an opportunity to do that, so my apologies, but today, We've got a really good one. We were thinking of, um, I asked mama, so what do you think we should do? And she's like, how about like something like warm winter meals? Is comfort that what she's food. Comfort foods. All the foods are comfortable to me. So I decided to do like a tortellini bake. It's gonna be really good. Anything with hamburger, cheese, and pasta. We're good. We're good. And um, I also got the red lobster biscuits to make. These take 17 hours um, and there's only eight biscuits in here. So we're gonna hurry up and go ahead and put those in the oven, but we're gonna get started on the accoutrement for the bake. So let's go. Okay, so I'm going to brown the hamburger. I'm also gonna add some garlic salt and salt and pepper and a little bit of Italian seasoning. And then after you get your hamburger brown and burger, you're gonna add a block of cream cheese and your sauce of choice. Now this recipe calls for marinara sauce, but I personally don't like marinara sauce. Um, so I just got like my favorite spaghetti sauce, but you can choose whatever you want. So this is the tortellini that I'm going to use. You can also use just whatever you want, but I'm going to do cheese tortellini and I'm going to go ahead and start that to boil before I do the rest of the meat sauce. Okay, so I've drained the hamburger and now I'm just going to add the sauce and then the cream cheese that mom has back there. Um, also, you can like flavor this however you want to, do whatever kind of seasonings that you like. It's literally almost just like, um, do you ever like baked spaghetti or like baked ziti? It's basically the same, only the noodles are just a little bit different because we're using tortellini and we're adding the cream cheese, which is gonna make it. And then we're gonna put ungodly amounts of cheese on top of it and throw it in the oven. So it's gonna make it so much better. Right, Debbie? Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so I'm gonna mix. We're gonna get this mixed up. Do you still have it? Mm -hmm. Debbie, what happened? Well, we have to turn it off. Debbie. So you could drain them. You're right. As usual. Okay. Cream cheese, please. Also, when I bought this cream cheese, it's like mad expensive. 
crazy. Okay, cream cheese, we're gonna let that melt. Mix it up. Okay, so this is what it should look like. Just make sure that you let your cream cheese get all melted and incorporated. And then we are going to add the tortellinis. Show the torts. Ooh, ah. Mmm, that looks really, really good. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna wanna get a nine by 13 glass dish pan, whatever. Um, I also saw somebody do this in a cast iron skillet. That would be good too. Anyway, you're gonna wanna spray this and then we're going to pour that in and then top it with all the cheese and then we're gonna throw it in the oven at 350 for, I don't know, 20 minutes. I mean, it's basically all cooked. You're just like melting the cheese. Basically, right? Right. Okay. I'm gonna dump now. I'm gonna bring the dish over there. Well, okay. Here, it's recording. What do you need? Ah, it's hot. Pray to God that I don't make a mess. A nice meat facial. <laughs> uh, okay, that's good. Everything came out. Nice. Debbie's having a heart attack. <laughs> okay, so we're going to spread this all out in our dish. Then we're going to top it with mozzarella cheese, all the mozzarella cheese, and some. Uh, Italian seasoning just to make it pretty. -da -da. Oh, by myself. I want to put my hands in here. I'm doing it. I'll only touch what we're gonna eat, okay? <laughs> Mom's getting constipated just watching me put all this cheese on here. But we need all the cheese. Don't we? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'll stop there on the cheese. Sprinkle some Italian seasoning. And then we're gonna put her in the oven. So our little biscuits are finally done and we're just going to brush them with the butter and the little concoction that it comes with. These are so good. So good. So also I was going to say, um, because we didn't do like the little appetizer video thing and I was talking about the sausage balls, I actually found like a new recipe to make my sausage balls with. Were they not delicious, y'all? Yeah. So good. So, instead of using Bisquick, you use the um, the box mix for these biscuits, and it's literally like the perfect amount of dry ingredient that you need. And then you use, uh, I think I did two different cheeses. I did pepper jack, and I did just like a regular cheddar like the small blocks of each. And then you, of course, mix that with your sausage. And they were so stinking good. I made them twice because they were delicious. Okay, so while we're waiting for that to um, come out of the oven, I was gonna say, we, we're gonna do a dessert. 
but we're not. I was gonna do a peanut butter chocolate uh, poke cake, right? That's what it's called. Mm -hmm. So I get here and I get all this stuff out, right? And I was like, oh, this is what we're gonna make. So I asked mom, I said, you know, what kind of dessert do you wanna do? And she's like, you know, I'll, you know, eat anything with chocolate. She said, Jeff likes lemon. And I said, okay, so I go to the store. I honestly didn't even know what I was gonna make until I got to the store. And I was like, anything with Reese cups, chocolate, peanut butter, I'm down for, right? So I got all the stuff to make this cake. And then I felt bad, so I got, um, I got Jeff a lemon pound cake. <laughs> So that's going to be probably our dessert. And the reason we're not having, do you want to tell them the reason we're yes, not having Yes, I do. It? Because I tried to make Christmas cookies and I killed the mixer. She killed it. Blew it up. Blew it, blew it up. Blew it all the way up. And I don't, Santa didn't bring me a new one. Maybe the Easter Bunny will. Perhaps. Or your, your Valentine. Maybe. That's what we should do. We should do like a, um, a, Valentine's, a Valentine's themed. Ooh, do you know what would be really good? A charcuterie. Also, have you guys seen those butter boards? Have you seen the butter boards? You don't like that? I'm not sure. I'm not that big of butter. I love butter. Girl. You can They're have all, pretty. Like, you can do all kinds of different butters. Mm -hmm. There are different butters. Yes, I'm just not really big on it. Or, like, you could also do, like, those um, spreadable cheeses. Like the uh, oh. those laughing cow things, you can use that instead of butter, mm -hmm. and then you use like uh, so you basically just like get a board, and you s smear and spread the butter all over it, right? Mm -hmm. And then you use like pieces of bread. Soften it. Yeah. I don't know. It sounds good. I don't know what we'll do. We'll try something. If you have an idea, let us know. Uh, but yeah, I can't make the cake because we don't have a mixer. So. Next time, we'll do that. Next time. Next time, yeah. Also, how'd your cookies come out for Christmas? They were horrible. They were disgusting. They were horrible. I threw them away <laughs> this morning. Actually, and I did exactly what, I mean, I did exactly what it said in the recipe. Yeah. I, did, I, I don't I know did, what happened. I did get a really cute little Instagram picture of it, though. As you were but that, to be honest, at that point, we didn't know how crappy they were We didn't know how be, bad they were. Because she was still making them. And it's funny because Reuben had the same idea. He was like, I want to make homemade sugar cookies for Christmas. I was like, have at it. So he goes and buys like all this stuff. He gets a sifter, like all these things, right? He takes like three hours getting the stuff together at like Betty Crocker, okay? He'll never watch this video. They were disgusting. <gasps> they looked pretty. They looked good. Tasted like ass. Well, and kind of deep down inside, I'm glad they did. Cause he made he made such a big deal. Of them. <laughs> they were so bad, and he kept walking in with one in his hand, eating it in front of me. Well, if I didn't like them, I wouldn't keep eating them. I was like, believe I me, I'm not gonna fight you for one. You can eat all the ones you want. I threw all those away this morning. They kind of Ruben's kind of tasted like yours. Well, Did I don't we understand it. Recipe? Like they had no no sugar taste to them whatsoever. No, and we put a ton of sugar in it. They were almost like shortbread cookies, right? Mm -hmm. But they tasted like a salty, like shortbread cookies with no sugar. Yeah, like burnt flour. Yeah, right. They were, they were not good. I'm sticking with the Blech. the roll, the sugar Filthy. cookie roll. That's hands down the best. Hands down the best. But they decorated theirs too. I think. Um, Ruben's mom and Mia decorated them. We tasted ours and said, you don't deserve You don't deserve icing. That's you don't deserve a decoration. No, that's sad. I that's tried. Sad. You I did, tried. Yes, you did try. They're made with love, but mm. yeah. Mm -hmm. But we did have a good time, didn't we, with the games and, yeah, and all we that did. stuff? Yeah, we had a great time. I had a blast. I had a good New Year's. Did you have a good New Year's? We didn't do anything. We stayed home. We made uh, taco salads and stayed home. Where'd y'all go? Mom went to the casino. <laughs> what did you have for dinner? I did. Uh, we had leftovers from other holidays. You still have leftovers? We ate everything that we had left at our house. There's just two of us. Just the two of us. Well, I don't know. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us. 
Just the two of us. Just the two of us. You checking it out, Debbie? Yeah, sure. Damn, that's a lot of cheese. <laughs> That's gonna be. <laughs> we made some, we made some cheese, cheese with a soup, little, little bit, bit of meat, meat. meat. tortellini. Yes. yes, that's gonna be good though. I want to um, uh, broil the cheese. I will if I can figure out your space oven. I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> I feel like we should have done a lot more because I don't think there's gonna be much to this video besides this. Well, we would have had dessert. But my cookie recipe <laughs> killed my <laughs> killed my mixer. Literally, and she was like mix it. It's like <laughs> <laughs> done. That should have been our first. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's exactly should have that. Yeah, yeah. These well, are gonna be trash, garbage. It's yeah. okay. I appreciate the. But thought. you know, I'm I'm not happy that um, Ruben's turned out that poorly. Mm -hmm. But kind of it validates right myself yeah because we kind of use the same recipe yes. and they both so just saying bad it was hey i'm not a girl that won't tell you if it's bad i think he just ate them i did to yeah. like make me feel inferior like he did a good job mm -hmm. i i have taste buds i also have birthday candle wax on there do you? I got most of it off. There's a little bit more. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. We so it was, fun. yeah, it was Brayden's birthday. If you saw it on the gram. Also, if you don't follow me on Instagram, please do. I don't know which way this turns. I keep forgetting how this flips. Up here should be where you would go and watch another video. If not, it's down here. No, if not, it's on this. Okay, so the tags are going to be the little boxes are going to be up here, but. I also made a new little Instagram thing, and it should, I think, pop up right here. So if I'm right, it should come up right about now. <laughs> if not, it's right here. Anyway, um, you know what else I figured out? I'm gonna show you here in about, let's say, five, four, three, two, one. I also figured this out. It's probably going to be over here, but I made a little uh, QR code for my Amazon store. Can you believe it? So, like, if you're watching this on your television or your computer or laptop or what have you, you take your phone. You guys know how QR codes work. Anyway, if you don't, I'm going to let you know. Do you know how a QR code works? Yes, I do. Get it, Debbie. So, you take your phone and you put it on the photo like you're going to take a picture. And you place it over the QR code, and it's going to put it in there, and then it's going to pop up a little thing, and then you tap it, it's going to take you right to my Amazon store. Isn't that great? It is, and I hope they have the right item. Yes, there are no dildos on this one. <laughs> if you don't know that story, <laughs> it's a good one. Do, should I tell the story? Should I tell the story? Okay, so one day, I had this lady, lovely lovely subscriber of mine and i know that she she comments like a lot so i know who she is right and she said what was she asking me about what was it that she was oh it was my shirt and it was one of the videos that i had made here she's like oh where'd you get your shirt from and i said amazon girl i've never bought clothes from amazon before but a couple years ago i bought a few shirts not this one this one came from bucky's thank you rosa anyway i said there's a link you know, here's the link, so, you know, send it to you. So about, I don't know, like a few hours later, she sends me a message and she's like, honey, I don't think that's the right link. I said, no, it is. I personally did it myself. I got, you know, she's like, no, I don't think it is. I think that's, that's something else. I was like, I don't know what, okay, let me go check it out. So I go and I click on the link and guess what pops up? Literally. A dildo not my shirt i felt i was so horribly embarrassed it was so bad but i have since gone back and checked all the links and they're correct so if there's anything that you were hunting for check it out in my amazon store there's a bunch of cool stuff in there i've added some new things in there too there's some kitchen stuff that i have uh more um pet stuff that i have oh by the way i found this i can't remember what it's called but anyway it's like a big egg it's like this big, it's an egg. 
right? Like plastic, and it's for dogs. And it's kind of like a weevil wobble egg. They're supposed to be able to like run around with it and scoot it all over the place and it like rolls with them and I don't know, it's supposed to be really fun. I'm gonna order that. That's in my basket right now. And oh, and another Chuck It uh, flyer. Chuck It Frisbee that, mm. that he loves so much. He's finally tore up the other one. Mm. Yeah. Or it was the weather because it sat out there for so long. Either way, I'm gonna get him another one. I'm gonna check it. Mom's gonna yeah. check uh, the cheese souffle. I'm so excited. Do y'all have your bowls ready? Are y'all ready to eat? You go right ahead. I'll go right ahead. Let me try to do this as, as nicely as possible. Look at all that cheese. Oh, yes. Don't forget those little bits. So good. So good. Do I smell? Is the oven turned off? I turned it off. Okay. It's off. It's probably because that's the first time you used your broiler. No. Okay. Tell me what you think. Do you have a tortellini on there? No. No. I have beef. Where's the beef? Is it hot? Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Try the tortellini. It can't be not be good. No, it's good. Move around all that cheese. Mm-hmm. And there's cheese in the tortellinis. Hope you don't want to go to the bathroom this week. I'm going to say, we have to tack a board across our butt to keep the mice out. That's true. Mine's going to need salt. Yep. Not mine. Mm -hmm. Good? Okay. I'm going to try. Do you want a biscuit? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No biscuit? Dang. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 That cream cheese? Mm-hmm. Holy cow. That's good. Y'all got to try this. That's really good. What did you say would be good in there too, ricotta? Mm -hmm. Ricotta cheese would be delicious in here. But that makes the flavor so good, doesn't it? It does. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. I'm... This is like going to be one of my new favorites. Okay. I'm going to make this more. It's delicious. It kind of... It kind of reminds me. It kind of reminds me of that. <laughs> the million dollar spaghetti. Oh, yeah. you, oh my gosh, that's delightful. But this, okay, let's try these biscuits out because they they don't look like the ones that come from the restaurant, but nothing ever really does. Mm. Don't waste your money on them. Mm -hmm. I would have been better off getting just like garlic bread. It's okay. We won't waste them. Um, anyway. That's it. That's all we have today. Thanks for helping me. Anytime. Um, let me know in the comments if you want us to do a Valentine's Day spread. We could do a dinner. A dessert. We gotta get Debbie a new mixer first. Mm -hmm. A drink. We can do drinks. All the above. That'll be fancy, huh? Yeah. Like we can Apple do that. Bees. Yeah, like Applebee's. Uh, so, yeah, anyway, I'm going to go eat. I appreciate you watching, and um, I hope you try it. If you do, let me know, because this is delicious. So, thank you. Come again.